Hey readers, welcome to reading time. Today I want to teach you a little bit about punctuation. And sometimes punctuation marks are kind of like road signs. When you're driving down the road, do you notice sometimes your parents might see a sign and they might do something like slow down or they might stop or they might see a green light so they go or they might read uh, like speed limit signs and they go a certain speed. Well, when you're reading, sometimes uh, books and poems and songs, they have certain marks and those marks are called punctuation marks. And those punctuation marks are kind of like road signs for readers. And they tell us how to read things. So like a period, those little dots at the end of a sentence, they tell us to read your sentence in a regular voice and then pause at the end of the sentence. Take a little break. Um, a question mark. If you see one of those like question marks, like doo -doo 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 -boop, you're going to read it like you're asking a question. You could kind of like make your voice higher at the end, like it's a question. Um, if you see an exclamation mark, like the straight line down and then a dot, you're going to read it like you're so excited. And then if you see a little comma, they're like those little kind of curvy hooks almost, you're going to read those. Well, when you see that, it means take a little pause. So they're kind of like road signs for readers. And I have a little secret. I'm going to show you guys your poem for, I think it's for next week. Don't tell Mrs. Brown I'm showing you this early. Um, seriously, don't. Because she loves this poem. But anyway, this poem has a lot of punctuation marks. And this is a really good poem to practice using punctuation marks to read. And you're going to notice like here's a exclamation mark, a period, a question mark, more exclamation marks, periods. And when I read this poem to you, I'm going to practice using those punctuation marks to help me read it. A, B, C's. A, B, C. D, E, F, G. H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O-P-Q-R-S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z. So readers, I used the punctuation marks to show me or to tell me how to read the letters in this poem. Okay? So when you're reading a book or a poem or a song, I want you to notice the punctuation marks and try to use those special marks as a code to how you read. So if you see an exclamation mark, read it excited. If you see a question mark, read it like a question. If you see a period, read it in your regular speaking voice. Make sure you take a pause at the end of the sentence. And if you see a comma, take a pause and a little baby breath, okay? All right, boys and girls, there is a link. It says using punctuation. You can click that link, and there's another video about how to do this. Um, and you can practice with your poetry notebook poems. You can practice with this ABC poem. I put it on the slide. Don't tell Mrs. Brown. Um, or you can practice it with your little books that uh, you have in your reading pouches. All right, boys and girls, have fun using punctuation to help you with your reading. Bye.